Hey guys, it's your boy Funny Sats, and today we are going to read another book. This one is about red. Wait, red. Hold on, red squirrels. I am going to do a double upload this day or today, so be sure to um, subscribe and hit that bell so that you know when these come out, when the next one comes out. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to get everything set. Okay, what are red squirrels? Red squirrels are small rodents found across Alaska and Canada. These mammals also live in the Rocky Mountains in the north northeastern United States. Now, the next book I'm going to read is going to be way longer than this one. So, for the next video, stick around long. Because this one will be a bit long. Not this one, but the next one. Okay, red squirrels have rusty red backs and white bellies. White fur surrounds their eyes during winter. Some grow ear tufts. Their bushy tails are thin for squirrels. They cur their curved claws and strong legs help them climb. And I forgot to show you guys the first page. So, take a look. And then, okay, their bushy tails are thin for squirrels. Their curved claws and strong legs help them climb. So, look at this page. Wait, oh, do. I feel like, comment down below which way is better. This way, or just this way. Comment down below which ones that I should do for now. Okay. Red squirrels are smaller than many other squirrels. They weigh about nine to seven ounces. One, nine, 198 to 255 grams. They grow to be about 10 to 15 inches, 25 to 38 centimeters long. Their tails measure about four to six inches, 10 to 15 centimeters of this length. Okay, I, to me, I feel like this way is better. Because it just helps, it's just easier to see. I'll be doing this for now on. I'm sorry if I'm making this book, this video, very long. Red squirrels usually live in forests. They are most active during early mornings and evenings. These squirrels bi build nests on branches and in tree holes. Some live in underground burrows. Red squirrels are omnivores. They often eat seeds, nuts, and fruits. They also eat insects, bird eggs, and mushrooms. Sometimes they lick up tree sap. Just look at these pictures and you'll know what they are. Okay, fine, I'll read them. On the menu, green pine cones, maple seeds, raspberries, eastern bluebird eggs, more mushrooms and acorns, that's what they like to eat. In the fall, the, squ the squirrels gather food for the winter. They store food in middens around their territories. Middens are often are often under logs, by trees, or in the ground. Okay. The squirrel is on top of that pile of leaves. So cute. And that's a hint. I chose this book because it looked cute. Okay, red squirrels guard their middens. They give warning calls when an animal is too close. They stamp their feet and jerk their tails. These squirrels also call when predators are near. Red squirrels avoid raptors like hawks, like owls and hawks. Animals to avoid. American martens, coyotes, bald eagles, great gray owls, cooper hawks, and Canada lynx. And comment down below 
while you're down there commenting about which way I should hold the book, just tell me if that doesn't, tell me if that looks funny. Because to me it does. Second to last picture. Squirrel kits. Red squirrels give birth to kits. In spring, some females have a second litter in late summer. At first, the newborns stay in the nest. Look, now in a bunch of babies. And just so you know, the babies are down there. If you don't see them, I'll have to zoom in. They're down there. Okay, now I can un... Ah! It's still scroll. Okay. That's better. They explore outside the nest for about... nest for about eight, eight weeks. Soon the squirrels find their own territories. Time to gather food! And that's the book. I'll read the glossary too. Burrows, holes. No, I. I'm just gonna read the ones that I do not know about. Piles of food that rodents hide. Animals that eat both plants and animals. That's omnivores. Middens. Raptors. Larger birds that hunt other animals. Raptors have excellent eyesight and powerful tailings. Okay. So, now time for the quiz. What do red squirrels give birth to? Comment down below. And while you're just, like, you know, doing, commenting down below which way I should hold the book, watch th the whole thing about, about this video so that you can write your answers for the quiz. And if you thought that that page about like the red squirrel yelling was funny. Okay, I need to think of a new one. Okay, what types of animals are red squirrels? Comment down below those two things, how I should hold the book, and if that page where the red squirrel is yelling, if it was funny. So if you do not want to miss these two videos that I'm posting today, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your answers for the quiz, how I should hold the book, and if that page about the red squirrel yelling was funny. So I will be seeing you very soon today. And I might just do my video right after this one, so stay tuned for the next one. Okay, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys!